As severe weather preparedness week rolls on, let's take a look at how you can stay ahead of the storm here as we head into severe weather season. Have ways to get weather alerts like a weather radio, certainly uh, a useful and very loud product to have. You can also download our 13 WREX Weather Authority app. Just go to your app store and download it completely for free. Have multiple ways. The more ways you have of getting those alerts, the better. You can also pick out a shelter spot. Should also pick out a shelter spot and stock it with those needed supplies. Think, you know, gallon of water per person per day sort of situation, as well, of course, medications. Rehearse this plan with everyone in your household. Now is the time to really get that plan implemented and rehearsed here during quiet weather. Well, we've got pretty quiet weather, not just here locally, but also really across much of the United States. The exception here over the Four Corners region this morning where some snow and some rain showers are developing. Even the threat for some severe thunderstorms north and west of Oklahoma City here, the panhandle of Oklahoma, dealing with just two or three weeks ago some bitter cold and snow, now dealing with the potential at least for some thunderstorm activity, a one on a scale of one to five. That's a marginal risk in that darker green shading of color there. Now, no thunderstorm activity here, not for really the next five days or so. As we go into the next uh, couple of hours, we've actually got to return to some sunshine. Right now, we've got mostly cloudy skies. Temperatures are in the low to mid 30s here area wide, except for Freeport. They were sitting at 29 at last check. We'll have clouds here through about the nine or 10 o'clock hour. Might even see some patchy fog here, especially between now and about seven or eight o'clock. Beyond that, Look at that sunshine galore temperatures back into the low to even mid 40s here later on this afternoon. Now it will be a little bit cooler than what we had yesterday. Of course, that first high of 50 yesterday, 43 for today. That cloud cover early on gives way to mostly clear skies. Six mile visibility currently in Rockford. Again, overall not too problematic here this morning, and it shouldn't be as you head out the door early on. Otherwise, we'll see mostly sunny skies here for your Friday, sunny skies for your Saturday. Let's take a look at your most accurate 10 day forecast. Notice the chance for rain returning to our forecast here for Wednesday. Looks like a warm, albeit wet midweek next week. So we've got some dry time to enjoy coming up.